every generation will not be confused there is a generation that will get this thing said the compressor feta pule kapas from that day the creative dimension of the prophetic there must be a performance because minutes no prayer point i'm going to leave you with the god of your salvation everyone you're going to cry and say father i can't remain the same not after this meeting those following online from any nation please pray you came to the house of god this is service to change your life think of your children while you pray think of your children's children while you pray think of the work god has given you while you pray Go ahead and pray. Pray. You're on your way to better day. Pray. Something is changing. You're on your way to better day. You're on your way to better days. Never weak again. Ah, you're on your way to better days. It's God's prophecy for your life. You're on your way to better days. Status is changing. There's no more decline. You're on your way to better days. Status is changing, no more decline. You're on your way to better days. You're on your way, on your way, on your way to better days. You're on your way, on your way. Go ahead and declare. I tap into this system of advantage. I fit on my background. I fit on my limitations. By the power of the Holy Ghost. I tap into this grace called favor. This grace called favor. This grace called favor. Favor with God. Favor with men, favor with God, favor with men, favor with systems, favor with structures, favor with gatekeepers. Pray. Pray. Hallelujah. Listen, I just feel stirred in my heart to give us one prayer point. Every spirit sponsoring any closed door because of my carelessness in complying with these principles. First, I obtain mercy, and then number two, I scatter that door. It must open for me. Every spirit that closes the door leading to the next level of my Christian experience, I obtain mercy. Mercy for dishonor. Mercy for being mediocre. Mercy for not understanding relationships. Mercy for not being prayerful and mercy for rejecting this impartation but then i command every devil lift your hands it's time for the door of my destiny to be open
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Please look at me. Listen. The law of impartation demands that number one, you must believe in God, who is the source of all things. Number two, you must believe in the vessel that he's using. Remember when there was a problem with oil, the instruction was go to them that sell and buy it now you know how you buy it buy it with honor buy it with value buy it with relationships i just gave you currencies buy it with honor buy it with value buy it with relationships buy it through prayer go to them that sell and buy our doors closing over your destiny then you need favor go to them that sell and buy is your business crashing your financial life crashing affecting your spiritual life you used to have time for god time for prayer time for worship to give to the house of god right now you who was on fire you've gone down spiritually because of looking for tea and bread go to them that sell and buy who is this king of glory the lord strong and mighty the lord mighty in battle amen who is this king of glory the lord strong and mighty For thine is the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. The power and the glory forever Amen. lifting and you're rising amen amen to the change of season You don't have to kneel but i want to pray for you he says such as i have give i unto you listen i don't stand by any human sense of bragging to claim there is nothing we have that has not been given by god but i will be lying and god will judge me if i tell you by the privilege of god's grace we have not obtained this grace also it's been difficult for believers listen every time god sends a grace and a word to jacob it is because of israel there are things you cannot do in your life until this mantle is upon you there are though you can't do end time ministry without the favor of god you will compromise beyond your imagination the key to integrity is not only character it is favor access to the hearts of men many of you will marvel at the things that happen to you i'm telling you that a door that for 10 years have refused to open you carry this esther anointing if esther as a village girl with one encounter with this oil oh it changed my life i'm indebted to god forever
Some of you are crying. Think of your children right now. You are about to receive an impartation. Think of mama at home. 10 years from now, add 10 years to your age. 20 years from now, add 20 years to your age. No achievement, no nothing. I don't want you to feel bad, but it's time to get serious. There is a system of advantage you have not tapped into. Few minutes and we're done. Those following online, following from whatever nation, God is giving you another opportunity again. Azaria family. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I know it works. Brothers and sisters, I know. I know. There is this grace. Mama, you may be old in age, but this grace still works. Apostle, I didn't have the opportunity to go to school. Find comfort. Favor works. Apostle, I'm tired. People keep disappointing me politically in business. Find comfort. I come from a village. It's difficult to even see the map. Find comfort. Favor is not a license for laziness. That's why I told you it's not just unmerited access. It is divine help. God and men in partnership holding your hands to lift you. Please pray one more minute. You're about to receive this impartation. Lord, you took my pain away and then you gave me joy. You're my peace, my melody in the center of the storm. You gave me a brand new song to sing to you. That's why I will lift up my voice and sing. Yeah, yeah. You've taken the pain and the sorrow away. You've given me peace undeniable. There's no need to cry cause you're always with me. You're my father, my everything. Yeah. now in the name of jesus who is the son of the living god i stand by this apostolic and prophetic office by the privilege of the election of grace and i stretch my hands first over you here in abuja our family in zaria those following from around the globe from america to europe to asia the caribbeans as many as are following and will follow in the name of jesus the one who has shown us mercy i decree and declare right now receive ye this grace called favor receive ye this grace called favor i papatos katabarakat koskiata I place this mantle upon your life. Take this grace now. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. In the morning, experience favor. In the afternoon, experience favor. In the night, experience favor. In Nigeria, experience favor. In America, experience favor. In Europe, experience favor. Every door that needs favor for, to be open, I declare may favor open that door now. Hear me? Every strategic relationship you have lost through carelessness and lack of discernment, 
I call on my God who is also your God. Let there be a supernatural reconnection now. Every door that dishonor has shut that was once open and dishonor shut it by the mercy of the God of David we reopen that door now and in the name of Jesus many of you are gifted but the favor to announce you is not there you are so gifted Gifted to a point that is institutions that should be patronizing your gift. In the name of Jesus, by the paparakatos katapakate parukoto vasiata, enteleke parus katebash kabaruz esiata. In the name of Jesus Christ, I give your gift visibility now. By this gift, let those who have the capacity to both discern and reward you. May they find you in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Hear me. In this new season of your life, every relationship you need to connect with. Some of you may not know them. International relationships, ministerial relationships. I declare, may that connection happen for you now. everyone anointed commissioned and ordained to find you and hold your hand in this season wherever they are i stand by the prophetic i call them into your life now yeah. hear me i stand under the corporate grace of the fathers of faith who have transferred these graces to us and under this corporate anointing i declare in the name of jesus as a contribution of this supply to the body of christ find the grace for favor <laughs> by this grace shame reproach hear ye the word of the lord let god's people go now hear me by this grace upon you whoever has forgotten you no matter how long in the name of jesus by favor may the book of remembrance be opened over you now even pharaoh who hated israel with passion was the one who ended up giving them gold and everything they used to build the tabernacle in the wilderness can i tell you this when favor comes upon you it's not only friends that bless you anybody directed by god i pray for you whoever must bring forth their credibility their time their resources their endorsement to shift you to the next level i call them forth by prophecy now Now, I'm praying for the body of Christ. But now let me pray for the Koinonia Global Family. You belong to a family that is mysteriously favored of God. I pray for you. In the name of Jesus, out of the abundance by reason of this prophetic connection, step into superior realms of favor. By this favor, may your life be a fearful wonder first to you and then to everyone around you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Please listen. Walk conscious. This, I, I want to encourage everyone. Please, please, just listen to the following instructions. Number one, please ensure at least three or four people listen to this message let it be your gift forget about buying recharge card or whatever 
look for at least three people maybe your family members maybe your husband maybe a director so you've been giving people money thank god for that you can go to i think it should be on our youtube page go there after this service personally i'm going to listen to this message this night again this is not the message to say i have heard go and settle down like a student in the school of the spirit listen to those points and pray remember every day you are doing it at your discretion it's not like we're doing it as a ministry pray every night lord open doors of favor and you watch what the power of god will do in your life but please listen to me from this week and for all the other weeks don't come alone well if there is no space if you have to sit on the roof sit on the roof invite your friends and your family this is not just coming for service there are graces there are truths that i'm going to be sharing by the spirit and i'm telling you at the end of this you will stand in awe the only thing you will be left with is tears and praise because when you see the way your life will move your company your ministry whatever it is let me make the altar call jesus is the foundation for not only favor but salvation please let's minimize movement we just thought on honor there are people in this auditorium there are people seated around the balcony all the overflows outside there are those following from different nations zaria you're saying apostle i need jesus that is the bottom line no cajoling no manipulation i need jesus or you are saying apostle right now i need to reconnect remember we spoke about relationships the first relationship you need is jesus wherever you are we have just one minute for you please i like you to leave your seat you're saying apostle i want you to please pray for me i don't want to return home the way i came wherever you are please leave your seat come and stand those from outside i like you to Thank you for watching our entire video today. If you feel you can bless someone, please join us and spread the gospel by sharing this video on your social media.